Welcome back to my show. I'm the Beard Venture. I'm Carissa. And on this episode, I've got the Zero Sugar from Cayman Jacks. It was a special request. Yeah, by me. Yes. Okay, so if you've watched, and I'll leave a link or something to my Cayman Jacks playlist. We've tried a bunch of these. Um, as far as the RTD ready to drink grocery store ones go, um, these have done really well. Mm -hmm. uh, I've gotten a bunch of people enjoying them. This is a zero sugar, and Carissa was like, hey, if I can keep my sugar down and my calories down, let's try that. So I hunted it out as soon as I found it, and now we're gonna try it. Now, neither one of us have ever tried this. If it's good, this is gonna be my pool drink for the summer. <laughs> Which is basically exactly what she told me when I told her, I found a zero sugar one. She's like, ooh, you found me the pool drink. Yeah. Because I've had many of the different margarita flavors, and they were all good. Mm, we even had good. some of the other ones, and they're all yeah, good. they're all good. Uh, it smells Smel good. <laughs> it, it smells like a Cayman Jack yeah. margarita. Okay. Yeah, I'm bringing that. This okay. Summer. I would say I think it tastes a little more spritey. Mm -hmm. um, it has an artificial sugar taste at the end. Mm -hmm. But not horrible, horrible. Yeah, I would not call this an abomination. No. Um, I mean, it's not like, oh my God, I just got smacked with some aspartame. Yeah. Um, but, I mean, there's definitely an artificial sugar flavor at the end. Which I kind of got to guess that's going to happen. Um, 94 calories. Okay. Um... I don't know. Um, I don't really see much on this. We'd probably have to look at the uh, whatever the six pack box is, but oh, that's yeah. way over there. So, um, you know, I would say for a diet, it's not bad. I don't hate it. I can do it. I mean, I like to make my own margaritas over buying margaritas in a bottle, but for bought margaritas in a bottle, they're right. pretty good. So, you know, as far as that goes, that's not bad. Mm -hmm. um, I, it's acceptable. I don't know. Yeah. Um... I mean, I'm not going to lie and Four say eight. you can't tell that it's zero sugar. Eh. Mm. You can. But, I mean, don't you kind of feel like if somebody's getting into that, they know that right. it's going to... Yes. Okay. I was mentally prepared for that. Okay. Because I drink mostly zero sugar drinks. But, you know what? Even though you taste that artificial sweetener at the end it doesn't stick in your mouth no i've kind of got a which makes me wonder what kind of artificial sweetener it is i've, I've kind of got a sprite yeah taste more fresca <laughs> more of a fresca -y. yes mate it's been forever since i had a fresca <laughs> it's more fresca -y. Mm. I think it's good. I mean, I, I'll drink. I'll drink more of them. Um, I don't think I like it as much as the original one was. Mm -hmm. Oh, uh, somebody wants to see it. I think I've. I think we could do a uh, comparison. Comparison. Mm -hmm. Oh, somebody wants to see it. We'll do a comparison. Um, I'd like to taste the difference side by side. I don't know. Maybe even if y'all don't want to see it, we'll do it. I don't know. <laughs> there might be one out in the beer fridge. I will go look when we're done. Um, yeah, I mean, you know, it, it's... It, uh, for for a zero sugar, I, I don't think it's bad. I don't either. I really don't. I think they, they did a very good job. All right. Well, let's get down to it. If you're enjoying this video, hit us with a like. I really appreciate that. I've already broke my thousand. Now we're just going for a few hours. Come on, watch more stuff. I'll oh, put man. it in the um, 
I'm going to have this in the new playlist. Um, so check out that playlist if you want to see a bunch of the Cayman Jack stuff. Now, um, I'll see what I can find to put down in the description. Uh, also, you'll find all my social media and all my, you know, all my stuff down there. Uh, let's talk about it down in the comments. Also, if you hit subscribe and ring the bell, you'll get at least three a week. Sometimes a whole lot more. <laughs> Just depends on how many I get. Depends roll on what kind of movies in. Yeah, sometimes I get in an editing frenzy and, well, I edited a bunch of them up. Um, okay, did you dig it? Yeah. Okay, if you just handed it to me, I'd be a meh. But me knowing that it's zero sugar, that is one of the better sure. mm -hmm. diet deals that I've had in a long, long time. I so, drink diet drinks, and I think I, I like it. Okay. So. Um, I really think this is a six pack worthy deal, especially yeah. like if you're trying to. Watch your calories and watch your sugar, sugar and stuff. And, yeah, I'm nah, not bad. Yeah. Now, the seekability is not going to be terrible because it just came out. And you're going to find it in a lot of major grocery right. stores and convenience stores. These are doing pretty well, which that's nice. I know there's a bunch of people that will be dogging on it because it is a yeah, RTD. Sure. Yeah. And it's a, but here's the thing. I like Cayman Jacks. So I, like I don't give a shit. Drink it if it tastes good. I mean, we tried the first, I tried the first one way back because somebody gave it to me and asked me to review it. And I was like, ooh, that was some delightful. Of those, some of those other flavors are delicious. The mojito is dope. The, the Paloma. Oh, the Paloma is off the chain. Uh, I wish I could find those all the time. They need to make the Paloma in a zero sugar. The uh, watermelon mm -hmm. margarita was pretty great, yeah. too. But... Um, now, I'm not really ranking this as a beer, but just as an RTD. Uh, on a scale of 1 to 10, 1's lowest, 10's highest. I'm at about a 6. I, I think against other RTDs, I'm probably at a 6. For a sugar-free RTD, it's pretty good. Up there for an, I'd do an 8. Okay. I understand. For me, I just don't... I, I, I can't do the diet flavor. Right. And I don't know for sure, but if it has aspartame... It'll bother me. It doesn't have an aspartame. It doesn't aspartame really have taste, that taste. So I'm really not sure if if it is aspartame. They did a really good job of disguising it. Yeah. Because it does not. It has an artificial sugar taste, but it does not have that aspartame stuck in your mouth. Ugh. So that that's that's good for it. But overall, it's not bad. Yeah. Well, there you have it. If you're gonna be chilling by the pool, I'm sure they'll have them in cans too. But that'd be nice. Cheers. Cheers.